dry ice. It's almost easier to find it in the summertime than the wintertime because so many people use it for camping. Dry ice is frozen carbon dioxide, 110 degrees below zero Fahrenheit. Can't touch it with your regular skin. That's why I've got the gloves. But I'm going to show you how to make a smoke ring launcher. It's absolutely amazing. Look at what I did. You can hear it even talking down here. I took a solo cup and drilled a hole in the bottom like this. Now I'm using this as a clear one so you can see what's happening. Then I took a bag and cut the bag and stretched it over the top using a rubber band. That's it. So um, pick up some dry ice and drop it into the cup like this. I swear you're going to do this over and over and over again. This goes in like this. Just find little pieces that will go in and now add the water and watch what you get. You get that bubbling action that you normally would, but now watch. If you tap the bottom membrane, look at what you get. You get these amazing little smoke rings that are there. Fast moving air creates that little smoke ring. It's called Bernoulli's Principle. I just call it amazingly fun. And it's a perfect thing to be able to do as a quick little DIY sci project. I'm Steve Spangler, and that's your Science Minute.